Hello, hello, Kenny Evans here. Another car video. We back in the car. <laughs> but yes, yes, yes. Um, let's get started with this here. So the title of this video is The Best Traits a Man Can Have When Dealing with Women. The Best Trait to Have When Dealing with Women. Now before I get really, really into it, I want to let you all know I'm all about helping men and women be the best they can be in all aspects of their life, not just in dating relationship. I know that's the main thing I talk about here, but also the health, wealth, and the mindset. I want you guys to be complete people all around, complete packages, total packages. You know what I mean? And of course, for uh, the people who are new or who have been here for a while, still haven't done so, subscribe, hit that notification button. You know what I mean? So you'll be notified for uh, whenever I... Uh, upload new videos and of course I want to throw this out to y'all let me know what other topics you want me to talk about because again this channel is for y'all and I want to help y'all be the best you can be so let me know what other topics you want me to talk about so, that all being said let's get into the topic so what is the best trait to have when dealing with women and this is obviously very important because um, you dealing with women. Watching this channel, more likely you dealing with women. And uh, yeah, you want to know what the best trait it is. Is so you guys could, you know, either if you have that trait, make it even better developed, or if you don't have that trait, learn the trait and then develop it so you have more success with women. And I'm not even gonna hold you guys anymore. <laughs> it is very simple, you know. But the best trait to have is indifference. Indifference is the key. You know, it's all very simple. You know, very, I mean, very easy to understand. When you're indifferent, you come off as you don't care. Kind of notch and lie. And you don't do it to try to get the woman to chase you. That's not the key. You do it because you genuinely know. If things don't work out with this woman, you will be all right finding another one. There will not be a problem. It may take more time. You may have to cycle through some women to get a woman on that level or better. But you, and eventually you will find a better woman and better women, depending on what you're looking for. <laughs> you know what I mean? So indifference is the key. You know, and on top of that, that goes with the abundance mindsets. And that's the same thing. Just knowing things don't work out here, things will work out better for you in the future. You don't have to worry about it. It's just, it's just about time. You know what I mean? So indifference is the key. And on top of that, when you have that indifference, you understand that you know what you're what you know your worth and you know what you want. You know? So essentially you have a standard. So you want a, a woman who's very attractive, but also has a great personality. And y'all get along, you know, ideally, whatever your standard is, you know what you want and knowing that you're not going to settle for less. Sure, you might have sex, you might have some 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 hookups with women who aren't there, but they're not going to be uh, in your relationship. You're not going to be in a relationship with them. They're not going to be anything really too serious, more than just a hookup or some casual sex. You know what I mean? So having that standard and knowing what you want and knowing your worth, knowing the value you bring, knowing in all aspects of your life, of course, that means you got to develop yourself, you know, but knowing the value you bring and knowing the kind of woman you want to share your value with, you know, um, it is important because, you know, when that woman doesn't meet that standard or she's not um, showing you uh, the value that you deserve, then you know you're willing to leave. Because again, you know you'll be all right. There'll be other women, and there's nothing to to hold you back. You know what I mean? So, but then also, knowing what you want, knowing your worth, you also have to, or in addition, that brings knowledge of knowing what you want and deserve. Knowing you, uh, knowing what you want and what you deserve uh, is going to be the best. Knowing you want and deserve the best. So again, 
And now you have a woman who may um, look good, but she may have a terrible personality. You know what I mean? So it's like, sure, you may hook up with her or you may not. But at the end of the day, she's not going to be in your life long. You know what I mean? It's just, it's just understanding that you deserve, you know, you want and deserve the best. So you got to do what you can to find the best, you know? And, and with that, you know, you're going to have women who maybe they have a great personality, but they're not very attractive. Or maybe I'll get along, but then, you know, in certain aspects, but in others you don't. Or, you know, you just, you, you want the best fit for you overall, you know? And it's very important that you always keep that in mind. Because if you keep that in mind and just the whole indifference mindset, that woman is constantly going to be working to, to um, um, show you that she deserves to be there and Voila, and that's my, my fourth point there. You have women, when you finally do get your women, but you have women who deserve to be around you. You know, whether it's your wife or you have multiple women that you're dealing with, they have shown that they deserve to be there. So it's bigger than even wanting to be there. They could want to be there, but then it's like, well, maybe they get tired and they just kind of, move on but they deserve because not only do they want to be there but they are showing you that they deserve to be there you know their actions you know what I mean so it's like those kind of women will be there forever you know what I mean as long as they are fitting what you want they want a casual they sit you know they get in the casual you know what I mean sure maybe over time they they may want more, but at the end of the day, they still want to be around you. And even if they don't get the relationship from you, at least they will still want to be around you because they've shown they deserve to be there. And they know that once they stop showing that consistently, they'll be gone. You know what I mean? So it is very important that you always keep that in mind that you have women who have shown that they deserve to be around you. But yes, uh, my final point, equally as important as the others, you always know you could do better. And that's not in an arrogant way, like you're looking down on women, but it's just you understand that if this girl, again, if she is not living up to your standard, if she's not showing you the value and the worth that you feel you deserve, you know you can find a woman who looks just as good, great personality, you know, great connection, or better, you know? You know you could do better. You know what I mean? And it doesn't mean, they're, even if they're miserable people, it doesn't mean there's anything wrong. You guys just aren't a good fit, you know? And even if a girl, you have a woman who, who looks good, great personality, y'all get along perfectly, but she's looking for a relationship and you're not, you got to move on, you know what I mean? Especially if you've tempted to, you know, seduce her, but she's just not, she's not biting, you know? And that doesn't mean there's anything wrong with her. It just means you guys are not a good fit. And you just have to move on to find a woman who looks just as good. Everything that she, that woman had, but fits more of what you're looking for. You know what I mean? So that is the key, understanding that you could do better. And that indifference mindset, the abundance mindset will always keep you ahead of the game because you're you're looking for reasons to cut them off. And that doesn't mean that you, you know, you don't like them. It just means you deserve the best and you deserve and want the best in life, let alone the women you deal with. You know, so I mean, that's pretty much it. That's all I got for y'all, man. So let me know what you think. If you like what I said or you don't like, you know what I mean? Leave a comment, you know? Especially if you want to dislike the video. Definitely leave a comment so I know and tell me what you disliked about what I uh, about my video. So I could if it's reasonable, I could correct it for the future. You know what I mean? Um 
course, subscribe, hit the notification button, because again, 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 this channel is not for me. You know, this is for y'all. And I mean, I want to help y'all be the best you can be in all aspects of your life. Uh, not only in your dating relationship, but your wealth, health, and your mindset. And again, on top of that, let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. You know, I want y'all to be well-rounded individuals. So let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. You know? And, uh, you know, if you found value in this video, I do appreciate donations. I do. Any, any amount counts. I definitely appreciate donations. You know what I mean? So, until next week, y'all stay safe, be at peace, and always remember, the strongest man is the happiest man.